these. I'm gonna go to a few different stores. I need to get some tablecloths. I wanna get a couple more games. If you guys haven't played the game Monikers, it's kind of like fishbowl. You can also make it yourself, but they have like look up fishbowl instructions online, the game, if you don't know what I'm talking about. It's like different levels of charades, essentially. It's really fun. So I'm gonna see if they have that game. I asked my sister to bring it, but who knows if she will. And I'm just gonna film kind of like prepping for this little game night. It will be fun. I'm gonna make a cheese board. I'm gonna order a bunch of John and Vinny's and it's gonna be a fabulous time. I didn't charge my car, so I hope I make it where I need to go. This one. I'm gonna just stop by the Ralph's around the corner and I need to get I forgot to get them here and while I'm still here I really can't be bothered to go back in I'm gonna put the food in these containers and heat them up and then this is my little game night I'm gonna put this with tin foil in the oven. Do some chicken in this one. This looks so good. Milanese, spicy fusilli. And then they gave a bunch of salad, so I'll put that in a big salad bowl, and then I have another salad coming. It's gonna be great. I just got these kale salads from Erwan, and I just got four of them. And I'm just putting them in. Oh God. Yum, gorgeous. Look at this salad. I love this salad. It's the white bean kale salad from Erwan, and it's so good. Dun, 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 dun. There. Can you put those little crackers on? There? Yeah. This is the most beautiful cheese board I've ever seen. The issue is, let's do this. So, look, got it, got it. I don't want this to go with that, so I will need to put this in a Okay, this is how you make it into a little flower. Give them a tutorial. Okay, now look at It's kind of, this one's like kind of falling apart, but it's fine. This isn't as sticky as the other one. Still looks good. <laughs> oh, <laughs> just fully fell apart. It fell apart. It's fine. We're just kind of like. What well, do we get the gist? That's how it's supposed to look. It's done. That is just so pretty. So now we can put these in the. Yeah. We can leave it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Gorgeous. <laughs> Maybe I'll just leave it like that. Look at all the games. I just got gifted a package from David Yerman. But look how pretty the bracelet is. I love it.
You can leave it. Okay, thank you. Have a great day. Thank you, you too. Okay, so first package from Toomey. So this is kind of like a full circle moment because all my luggage is Toomey and I've had it since I was very young and it's my favorite company ever, so. I've never received anything from Toomey. Has my name. This is their new Georgia tote. It's gorgeous. It's like a perfect little travel bag. You put your computer, chargers. It'll go with my Toomey luggage. <laughs> Thank you so much, Toomey. Thank you. Let's see. Cute. Little pink Puma shoes and little white Puma shoes. A little workout set. I think this is a dress. Looks so cozy. Ooh, perfumes. I love their packaging more than anything on planet Earth. Little perfume. Green Fig Cleansing Balm. These are my favorite products to take my makeup off with. My sister actually just called me and she was like, how do I get mascara off? I always have so much trouble getting it off my eyes, da da da. And I was like, you need a cleansing balm, like the Elemis one. So, I have a bunch of these. I'm gonna give one to Bella, but I'm keeping this one because I want to try it. <laughs> the Alchemist. Oh, I want to read this book. The Body Keeps the Score. I saw somebody talking about this on, I think I heard it on a podcast. So I ordered it. Good morning. My water bottle matching my pajamas was completely unplanned. <laughs> um, today it's a little bit gloomy in LA, but just waking up, I woke up feeling a little sick or not sick, but just like my throat feels a little bit iffy and uh, I just, I don't know. This is like the fourth time I felt this way this month. So I don't know if it's something in my new house. I've had it checked for mold and all that type of stuff. Anyway, we're gonna get up and go make a coffee and start the day and I have plans with Lily, one of my girlfriends. I have a nail appointment at 3.30. I have some work I need to do on my computer and also following up with some stuff for the brands I'm creating. And yeah. I also got some jewelry pieces from Shop G2G that I wanted to show you guys. Okay, first of all, how perfect are these silver kind of bubble hoops? I love them. I think I want to wear them. I don't normally wear silver jewelry, but I do really like mixing metals. Like, I don't mind mixing silver and gold. So, that's pretty cool. How cute. I think I am supposed to be sharing these things with my sister and my mom. Shop G2G is my aunt's brand, my dad's sister. And just my favorite brand of jewelry. There we go. Pretty. Ooh. Wow. Look at this. Can you see that? Ooh, pretty ring. <laughs> My sister and mom <laughs> are gonna watch this and be like, Olivia, you're supposed to give us some of this. Oh, this fits perfectly. Great. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, you see, like, that's the thing. I'm not giving this to my family. This is so amazing. I think it's too much, but I don't care. Okay. I'm wearing too much now. But, I like it. I think I'm kind of going through a phase where I regret cutting my hair. I can't. What is the 
The toxic dog? Yeah. He's a fellas. <laughs> <laughs> toxic boy. This is the best eyelash curler to ever exist. And me and one of my best friends, Elizabeth, had a debate about if her eyelash color was the best to ever exist or if mine was. So she was asking me for what mine was. I sent her it. She bought it. She texted me like a couple days later like, yours wins. Like This is insane. So I'm going to link it down below for you guys. But it's just amazing. Even I curled my lashes the other day and my sister was like, did you curl your eyelashes? Because they look so crazy. See that? I'm going to link it. I got your back. Gorgeous. I also feel like my background in this room is just so ugly. I forgot I put concealer on, so I just put that over it. Okay, I'm gonna leave my hair clip because I can't be bothered to have it in my face. I need a coffee. I can't believe I've lasted this long without a coffee. I'm also gonna link my glasses below. They're not reading glasses or um distance glasses they're blue light glasses i'll link them when i got i think i just got them off amazon but i'll put a link in my description box for them they have really changed my life i used to get the worst headaches ever from looking at the phone screen and looking at the computer screen when i'm editing or doing emails or just wasting my time scrolling i like these ones specifically because i have another pair of blue light glasses but i feel like they zoom in a little or they're like a little bit magnifying so I can't just wear them around the house like these like don't feel like anything when I'm looking around it's fine and then when I'm just on my phone which is a lot because my job is on my phone um it's just like I don't get crazy headaches so oh also for y'all ask I used this Huda Beauty lip contour in honey beige and that's kind of what I did just to make them look nice and juicy and then there's like a little bit of road peptide under but I did the road peptide first like way earlier this morning so there you go Marvin I'm gonna try some of those coffee beans oh uh, you like it? I'm gonna try it right oh. now oh okay I'll let you know thank you <laughs> you're welcome I'm so excited So my housekeeper is my favorite person probably ever. I love him. Um, he went back to his home, which is in Guatemala, and he brought me back coffee beans and rum from his home. Is that not the most thoughtful thing ever? So I used his coffee beans that he bought me. And I just think it's like, it made my whole existence, basically. I just think it's like so nice and thoughtful. Mmm, it's like almost like has like a little bit of like a oh my god. I really like this Mmm, <gasps> and I'm gonna make a matcha <laughs> As well, I don't need this much caffeine, but I like it I'm gonna go in my little coffee and tea drawer Got all the goods. I use the Alfred's matcha powder it was kind of offensively expensive for that tin, but I guess matcha's expensive. I didn't know. And then, this is the milk that Alfred's uses, I noticed, at their coffee shops. And also some other really great coffee shops use this in their matchas. It's the barista blend, so. It's like Alfred's at home. Get a bowl. I like whisking my matcha with hot water as opposed to cold. I feel like it gets less chunky and it like dissolves better. I don't like when there are like little matcha powders in my drink. This has just become my designated matcha cup. Don't know why. Ice. Take like a teaspoon. It's probably gonna spill everywhere. But I'm just gonna take a little hot water from my coffee machine. Whoa. 
I'll see you when I'm bouncing off the walls. Got my coffee, got my matcha. I'm gonna shoot this ad I have to do for seed. It's pretty easy, I've worked with them a bunch, so I kind of know the rundown, and also I love their product. And on top of that, I actually need to take my vitamins this morning. So we're gonna do all of that. I'm also gonna fill my water up and put a little bit of like my Armra Colostrum packet in there because I've been loving that and I just feel like I really wanna keep my immune system strong right now. I feel I'm a little under the weather, but it's not super bad. And for my best friend's wedding next week, I need to just be fine. Oh, I have to take pictures while I do this. <laughs> This video is not sponsored by the way, I just, this is for something else. Um, I do feel like seed works the best on an empty stomach. I know I have coffee and matcha, but I feel like it's fine. I just need on food. Okay, I've switched to my phone and my bridesmaid dress doesn't fit me. So that's great. Very stressed. Lily and I are about to go on the hunt for address that bit um yeah should be interesting well i also have to find dress for my shoes for my rehearsal dinner dress okay. what do you think like just too teal yeah, i just think it might be a little too teal yeah these are more green i think this one's stunning. Good morning, everyone. I have a really, really busy day. <laughs> it's Saturday, September 16th, so I'm uploading this video tomorrow. I'm shooting in pretty real time, and I'm planning on vlogging my entire day. That's the goal. Here's what's happening. It's my sister's birthday. I was supposed to vlog all day yesterday, and then I had a little bit of a crisis, one would say. I am in a wedding next weekend. It's my best friend since I'm a little kid. Her wedding. And I'm a bridesmaid. And I had my dress. I tried it on at the beginning of summer. Never tried it on again. And I had my other best friend over yesterday who's the maid of honor. Sorry for the pillow. Anyway, I was like, Lily, can you try and get me in this dress? We cannot zip it to save my life. Would not get on my body. It was not happening. So, I'm running around town trying to get this dress. I finally get a dress. And then I have to go buy shoes. And my whole vlog day just fell apart. I should have vlogged all that, but I was so stressed because the wedding's in one week. I took like some video clips, I think, that maybe you saw. Maybe you didn't. I don't know. It's around 8 o'clock in the morning right now, and it's my sister's 25th birthday. So, I ordered a bunch of ingredients to make her a coffee cake. I make a really good coffee cake. I've put it in a YouTube video before, but I'll film it again. So good. It's like genuinely one of the best coffee cakes I've ever had. I'm gonna go to the store and I wanna get her a bunch of tulips, because that's her favorite flower. I was gonna order donuts, but I just feel like the coffee cake feels more thoughtful because I had to make it and it kind of takes a while to make. And I also have a nail appointment in two hours. So she's coming to my house. And it's eight now. I want to get a workout in as well. And I really need to edit a lot of this video because I don't really have time today to edit. So I think on the treadmill, I'm going to edit. I actually need to wear these glasses. They save my headaches. I also need to put my workout stuff on. I'm gonna wear a workout dress. I'll link this one down below. I'm up, I'm moving, we're good. I need a coffee before I work out, but look at these shoes I bought. I got these yesterday and I think they're incredible. I need a coffee and then we're gonna work out and then, oh shit, I do have to get the groceries. 
Oh my god. Turn my coffee machine on. I got the groceries. I got a baking tray so I can just leave it at hers. Parchment paper. Brown sugar, I didn't have any left. And buttermilk, you mix these together and put them in the batter, it's so good. I ran out of this, so I got more. Airborne gummies, because I love the taste of these. I also have butter and I got honey, but that's not for the recipe, hold on. I wrote it all down in my cookbook last night. The only thing I'm questioning is if I spelled streusel right. Everything else I think is spelled perfect. I just never used that word streusel. I think I did though. I'm pretty good at spelling. <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> Shut up. I'm gonna put my sneakers on. Get this workout done. If you're wondering what I meant by I'm gonna do work while I'm working out. This is what I meant. That was great. Finished the treadmill. I got like, I literally, my video is like four minutes edited. That's how long that took, and I did 12, 3.30. Bella's birthday crumb cake. Let's make it. That can be put to the side. The brown sugar. Half cup melted butter cooled. Okay, while I'm waiting for the butter to cool a little, I'm gonna do the big mixture. Cup of sugar. Half cup softened butter. We'll do two eggs and vanilla much you want. In a little separate bowl, I'm going to do the buttermilk and sour cream mixture that we'll put in here when this is blended. One cup of sour cream and half a cup of buttermilk. Do a half cup buttermilk. Smooth. I'm still waiting for my butter to cool a little bit for the streusel. So. Great. We mix that all up and we're gonna add two cups of flour, half a teaspoon of kosher salt, one teaspoon baking powder, one teaspoon baking soda. One cup. Baking soda. One teaspoon baking powder. And then we will add the sour cream buttermilk. And this is our batter. I'm gonna just hit it with this. Gorgeous. Okay, I think the butter is cool, cool enough now. We can just pour that into the streusel. We'll get a clean fork. And you wanna keep this kinda like, you know the tops of coffee cake, how they're really crumbly? That's kind of how you wanna mix this. So you just wanna take a fork and keep it really kinda crumbly. See? like that. So I'm gonna line my baking tray with some parchment paper and we'll do half the batter, cinnamon sugar, other half the batter, streusel. We gotta do the rest of the batter. It 
It was a messy baking video, but she turned out looking gorgeous. I'm gonna do like powder sugar over the top when it's done, but yay! I'm addicted to those airborne gummies. It's actually a problem. <laughs> I just got my nails done. Just did like a nice little baby pink. These are my real nails. I got the same color on my toes, but I'll spare you because I have the world's ugliest feet. The banana, or I didn't make banana bread. The coffee cake is done and I'm gonna do some powdered sugar on top. It's pretty spectacular, I'm very proud of it. I'm gonna put some powdered sugar. I feel as though I might have outdone myself. This looks so delicious. I hope she likes it. So from the game night, I had leftover tins and a lid, so I just picked up the paper and put it in here. Now I need to get ready. I'm gonna get ready really quick and I'll see you guys after. Um, it's really gloomy in LA, so I'm gonna put something kind of warmer on the warmer side on. Okay. Hi guys, I just got ready. I'm just wearing a corset and then I have a long denim skirt. These heels are really cool because they're square. We're gonna go to my sister's. I'm picking up breakfast and flowers on the way. We are driving to Bella's apartment. I switched my jacket. It was kind of giving like grandma vibes with the sweater. Okay, so the plan for today is we have Bella's birthday right now I'm going to her apartment I'm bringing her the coffee cake and the candles and I'm picking up breakfast and I'm gonna pick up some flowers and then we're all gonna drive to my Aunt Rose's 100th birthday party it's such a crazy thing to think about my great-aunt being 100 years old like that's just so much life and um, she's still very spunky God bless her um, because 100 is just crazy. <laughs> Tonight we have dinner at one of my favorite restaurants in LA for my sister's birthday. She's 25 today. So in my last video, I asked a lot of you guys like how long you've been watching my videos and a lot of you said like since high school or for like, like literally almost like eight, nine years, which means you would have known Bella when she was in her teenage years as well as me because she was always in my videos. So it should just like mind you a little bit that she's 25. But then again, I guess that would make all of us in our 20s at this point or older. Okay, we're gonna go get Bella some flowers at this little shop. I'll show you guys what I end up getting her. I love the colors you chose. Yes. They're so beautiful. I will show you something. Else. Okay. Wow, those are beautiful also. You're very talented. Thank you so much. <laughs> if you can just tag us. Yeah, sure. Card, please. This is my business card. Thanks. I'll put it on YouTube. Oh, the thank purple you so much. rose. Yep. That's me. Got you. <laughs> thank you so thank much. You. I appreciate, appreciate it. it. Thank you. He made those flowers like 20 minutes ago. How lucky am I? Look how gorgeous. I just put it in the maps and it was nearby that I was driving past it. And he makes the most gorgeous flowers. So that was awesome. I love him. He rocks the purple rose. Off to my sister's. Well, no, off to pick up the food, breakfast, and then to my sister's. I have it all. Flowers, coffee cake, the food. I hope the food's still good because probably been sitting there for like 20 minutes and it's breakfast food so it's gonna be like 20 minute old scrambled eggs <laughs> but Bella got yogurt so that'll be good she's putting her flowers in a cute little vase it's just crumbly whoa it's gorgeous it's really pretty wow gorgeous there we go Bella, remember those prank candles mom and dad used to put in our cake? Yep. And we couldn't blow them out. They would yep. just keep relighting. Yep. Happy birthday, birthday to, to you. Oh, 
Oh, baby. Woo! All in one breath. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, boop, boop, about boop, the boop. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I don't know why I did that to you. <laughs> You're up to three. I've gotten you three cakes now. <laughs> Two birds. Delusional I am in my life at this point that I just like don't even remember. <laughs> Get it just water. Cheers. Happy yeah. birthday. Thank you. Happy birthday. It's her birthday. Cheers. Oh, hey. <laughs> chic. Don't she look great? Yeah. Why do you so look good. So She's so I cute. Love her Very cute. You're see, so cute. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm gonna end this video here. Sorry, I kind of forgot to film towards the end of the video, but I feel like I did a pretty good job forgetting most of Bella's birthday. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next Sunday. Bye.